novice. Okay, who's the best girl from Persona 5? Oh. If you say anything that's not Futaba, you're wrong. Um, it's Kawakami. Well, you're wrong then, because no, it's- No, I'm not. No, Carson, don't you understand? It's either Futaba... Kawakami. What's her name? Or Doctor. Or- Or! Or, I quickly earn there is her. another there are there is another option uh, because Makoto is actually a very popular uh, wait, 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 when we're and, and, like, and, and, and if Brian were here he would have said Makoto when we're talking uh, about uh, like uh, best girl <laughs> we're talking specifically oh this is trophy didn't even have time to spawn Woo! Uh, are we talking specifically among the parties or are we counting everyone if you're counting it, I mean what, you just get these? Yeah. I mean, realistically... Oh, fuck yeah. Oh, yeah, wait, if you just get them without having to do a stupid gun thing, we can get them all then. about party members, and it's Futaba or it's Makoto. We... We can try! Or, you know, other popular, um, answer is Yusuke. Might also go back to... Yeah, but fucking... <laughs> not a joke. Uh, I'm sure it's not. Well, in Persona, everyone is best girl. But, I mean... Okay, because you played. Oh my god, I love yeah. how they're. Yeah, okay, because you've played Persona 5, what the fuck is the connection here? What, what do you mean? Uh, Yusuke uses a samurai sword. But, I mean, I guess. That's two! This is the closest we could get, was, um, Krom. <laughs> Blue haired swordsman. <laughs> yeah. That's two! It made more sense than, you know, I. Because. Oh, I feel like Marth would have been a better option. Um, and, you know, that's probably about as close as you can get on that one. Because if I killed it so fast, you so. can't see. You might actually want to swap around. Sometimes they can actually be problematic if you're the um, non-super effective type. You bring up a. Because it is attack, you could go back to my old setup, which is giant dad. What the? <laughs> what the fuck? Hold on. Uh, you're. Yeah, I, I never favorited any primaries. I only favorited the support ones. Because for the primaries, I would just go by power. Yeah, so... So then turn the uh, favorites off. On. I just want to save it. You keep pressing it twice. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. There. That's why I was trying to... Oh, it's just gonna break it in half, I see. It's a fucking but, get! I know uh, this because, one! Like, because he, he killed the Fruit Harbor one so quick. It oh, it, it's a combination of, like, what the character looks. It's someone based off what the character looks. Oh my looks. god, it's a mo Oh my god! Okay. That's beautiful. Explain. Uh, she, her persona's a motorcycle. Yeah. Uh, like, <laughs> it's literally. Like, her persona is literally a motorcycle, and then turns into this weird yeah. mecha thing. That's like, to explain the Futaba one, it was the inkling because of the orange hair you were fighting. Okay, so we've got... You were fighting her in the Super, Mo um, the Super well, this Mario this, stage. This would make sense, because this girl, uh, she gardens, but also her weapon is an axe. What's her persona? Um, it's Daisy, so I'm going to assume it's Silky or uh, uh, something you know, like that. No, I'm kind of curious as to what they're going to use for that because I don't know what they're going to use. It's oh my god, she's getting the axe! Daisy is it... beautiful! Bye! Yeah, it's Daisy and it was Daisy holding a super scope. Um, well, I win! Thing. Her other thing was that she used gun. Uh. She's, um, she's weird because she's gun. Um, she's gun psych. Psy? Okay, so we're, um, we're doing these Sai so. Sai does extra damage if they're under a status helmet. The issue mm. is that the only character who does status helmets is at on, and she doesn't do that many. Mm. So Let's I mean, try to wipe these so, out! I mean, Haru really only synergizes with you. Fucking cannon ban over here. That makes sense, because um, <laughs> On's blonde and has a whip. And yeah. what's her persona? Because the character her that persona? Oh. the character that comes in is Peach. It, it's like this. Yeah, that makes sense because she's fire. Yeah, it's Peach with a fire. I mean, it's, it's, yeah, it, there's nothing special about her persona. <laughs> Visually, it's just did like, I just? Uh, it's Carmen. Did I just kick? Uh, yes. Did I just kick her off? The yes, the boot. 
But anyway, like I said, I was trying to explain the, the Futaba one. That one was the Dark Matter Assist Trophy. No, uh, not Dark Matter. Nightmare. What type of... He's Grab, so you, you, no, you, you, want, you want Grab. No, he's Shield. He shields, so, so you yeah. want Grab. That's... But like I said, the Futaba one... Back to that like, nonsense. The, even though he doesn't get any boost from magic, but it's just the stats. But the Futaba one... We're was here for... Giant Ganon! Uh, I understand why he has a baseball bat, but I'm not sure why it's Captain Falcon. Isn't he a... That! That's funny! Why? What is that? I mean, his uh, his persona is literally a captain with a gun arm. Oh. A cannon hand. <laughs> it's literally a hand cannon. <laughs> the deepest of cuts... <laughs> Because of this one, I wanted to ask this more. Gravel. To learn electric skills. Gravel no, he means he wind. Why is it Pikachu? Uh, that's probably the closest thing we had. Gravel. To win. Gravel be is loses to attack. Yeah, that's. So then you can go giant, Dad. I could. Become giant. I hate Dark Souls, but I fucking love that, well, here's that the, meme. The problem is the wind. If you kill them fast enough, you don't need it. You know what? I'll give it a- <laughs> Become giant! Oh, is there wind? Yeah! Because you said the fight was wind. Yeah. Ready? And then- Oh my god. Oh, I was about to say it's tiny, but I think it was just big. No, it's both. That's hilarious. Damn it. And then it's a- You know what, Carson? Incineroar was an ore club? <laughs> What's more Carson was persona? Right. I, I, it's Zoro. <laughs> Why did why was it an insane room with a clock then? Um, okay. Okay, wait, hold on. I want to see this next one. I forgot to fight him. No, that's this. Or her. Why is it? What? Why is it Marth? Well, I won't, we're going. Uh, it's Marth and. We're going giant again. I mean, he's Robin Hood. I feel like. It's Marth and he has Pit as a, another character. So, do they get an angel? No, he is Robin Hood. Oh. Ready, go. Well, I mean... Spoilers! He also has Loki. Uh. Booyah! Because he has two personas. Three more! Because he review. That's why you can't you can't get Loki in Persona 5. It's the because ice Because he also has Loki. Which mm. is extremely fitting to his character that he would have both... So, okay... Mm. And he'd have Loki. But anyway, the point, the thing I was going to try to ask because I know Futaba's starting Carson's persona nonsense. is the it because I know Futaba's starting Prometheus. persona. Is, I thought it was the Necronomicon and it becomes Prometheus. Yes. So do they learn dark and like death spells? She be, she because of that. Oh. She she's your uh, she's your um mystery. Uh. In, anyway, because of that, the, oh, come the, on. the fight for her, the assist trophy would have been nightmare because you know darkness and all that. That was the point I've been trying to uh, make. But you were basically sitting here being like, "I understand that reference." <laughs> I watched that movie. What? I understood that reference. <laughs> they were the Perrys. Like, holy I mean, shit! They're game. trying to be the twins. They have EOP. Yeah, I was gonna say with the twins, that game Super Bowls because Yeah, they're the Because like, after the is always Super Bowls. Yeah, because I win! After Alice Fucking they started Ganon, man. doing that. Alice? Wait, what was that like who was the one from Persona 3? Elizabeth. Oh. That makes sense. Why is it why is it three Ridleys? Back to Carson's giant I like three Ridleys. He, he has three Ridleys as a assist. I don't know if he's Igor. <laughs> I guess. Why the hell not? Yeah, I guess it's. <laughs> Start with 300% damage? You might want to use Lucario for this. Oh, you're healed significantly after a while. Why does he have three rippies? And they're all blue, so it's. It's also Robin in the place of Igor. Like. Because Igor never. Well, I mean, I, he has the book. He has a book like the compendium. What? Did not. I'm not sure of the reference. Now the Phantom Thieves themselves. The, the myth, the legend. And these just stay here. It's almost like they learned. Hold on. So I might actually. The giant's good, but then it fades. So I might go. Hey, that's. 
Well, actually, uh, the Little Mac is a legend, but you get far less power from it. I might try the giant again. If you... You know, something you could have done is equip the... They start with 50% damage, or the minions start with less health. <laughs> Poor bastard. If you look at that, you can... If you uh, play like Ganondorf, you can literally uh, basically one-shot everyone. Only the legend killed, man! It was only... It was only... Actually, what killed you was Ganon having a shit recovery. Yeah, he d never use his up tilt. So yeah. what's the significance of the Daybreak being here? That's how you kill my boss. Oh. You're a big gun at it. Ah. Uh. And then Joker said jackpot. <laughs> you know, in a way, Joker is kind of basically us getting Don Pay in the game. Yeah. Oh yeah, I can get sudden final smashes and stuff too. So. Uh, speaking of... Devil May Cry 5, did you know you can get a two of Lady's Rocket Launcher? Yes, I have it. Did huh. you know that uh, when you beat the game outside of Spartan Mode, you literally un unlock this ability that lets you use a slot for every one of your weapons? Oh shit, Joker! Including different versions of the same weapon. And because of this, you can literally equip both the both the rocket launchers and the double rocket launcher. Oh god damn it! Just so you have more things to have to switch between. Why would you want oh, that? Oh Jesus! Are you asking practically? Yes. You wouldn't. So then why is it there? He, for people who are crazy who like that kind of thing. Fuck you! Ha ha! Ha! And I killed him with a laser! Best way to win! Phantom Thieves! I did it! And they ha have items. I defeated the final boss! I... Okay, I know I lost and I might have cut past that, but I'm happy I killed him with the laser. That was the best way to end this shit show. Also, have you seen the ridiculous stuff you can do with spells? Holy shit. No! One of. Uh, yeah, you can do a lot of ridiculous stuff with No! One other thing, just. We have lots of options in that game. Now, one other thing, just to quickly show. That game knew what it was doing. It's really. The, ga the game knew how to be fun. Shine on. And it actually has an amazing amount of content in it. You need to go uh, look up what you get for the higher difficulties. I'm probably about to just do like I'm a being, three. Um, Son of Sparta. I'm on Dante Must Die. But I found something out at the final boss of Son of Sparta. And at the beginning of Dante Must Die. Alright. I don't know how we're going to do it. Mm. I'm patting this out for a minute, just to... What the hell are you doing? Oh, I just thought a little bit. I wanted to show off something, but... I wanted to do a fight, but then midway into this, I decided to make it... First off... Oh, there's the other Son of Four track. Yeah. Oh, it's the other battle music. So it's the standard battle music? It's the golden battle music. So golden and regular have different battle music? Uh, kinda. In regular you have, uh, Reach Out to the Truth. But in right. golden they have Time to Make History. But and you you're also, you're fighting a yellow Yoshi. But Holy if, shit, all this worked out. But if you get, um, the, the player advantage... Um... Holy shit, because of that I didn't notice, but Joker's icon is also a different color. But if you get the um, player advantage, you'll play, um, reach out to the I just mostly game. wanted to show Sean the one other cool thing that they did. Why didn't you go into training to show it? No, because oh, now yeah. this cool thing, I just wanted to see him get a kick out of this. Oh my god, that's beautiful. It also, it changes. Oh my god. Face, it like, changes the victory music. No. Yeah. No, that, that was why I picked yeah. Mementos. It's the victory screen. Yeah. And yes, you get the Persona 3, 5, or 4. I picked the Color and victory music. I just wanted him to see that. 
Um, the best part about that is because Joker has the but, custom animation of running. If you win a team battle, the other people on your team are nowhere to be found. They're just not even in the animation. What were you talking about? Like, if you beat someone with his final smash, it transfers directly to the end of screen. If you kill someone with his final smash. Wait, oh, it does the, it does the, kill, the, the kill thing? That yeah. would be hard to show off. That is awesome. Yeah. But because the training doesn't. Wait, it, but it literally ends the battle like if you would win it with an all attack. Yeah. yeah that's, that's cool. But that, that would be a pain in the ass to show off. I'm probably about to end this recording. I mostly want to shine for a minute to see the one battle. So I just did a solo mm. stock with um just a standard battle. Showed a couple of Joker's moves for a minute. Showed it mementos so that we would get the victory screen because I wanted him to see that specific Easter egg. Mm -hmm. Now, uh, just to check the music while we're here. Last surprise. Last surprise. Ah, oh, there it is. Beneath the mask. Beneath the mask. Not that one. New, new remix. remix. Not that one. Wake up. No. Uh, wake up. Get up. Get out there. Oh my god, it's there. Rivers in the desert oh are god. beginning. Reach out to the truth. I'll face, I'll face myself. New, new remix. remix. Time to make history. Mass destruction. Battle him of the soul. It combines battle him of the soul and um, what you call it. And then Aria. The, the soul. soul. New remix. Oh, so specifically the Persona 3 Velvet remix. Mm. And the new remix means it's a new Smash remix. Mm -hmm. So, but, and that's just... Oh my god, they had, I, I'm so glad they have Rivers in the Desert. So, I'll face myself, new remit. Yeah. Which one of the music tracks was Sean talking about that he was asking was in this game? That Rivers in the Desert? Oh. Yeah. Which is just Rivers in the Desert. It's not a new remix. It doesn't need to be a new remix. It just needs Rivers in the Desert. Dun, dun, dun. I didn't mean to do that. Dun, dun. I, I was about to exit. I just accidentally hit the... Okay, this was enough Joker for now. Oh, yeah! Hold on. I, I need to go back in because I did something. Uh, I accidentally set it to Rivers in the Desert. I'm setting it back to the random. I hit the wrong button when I was trying to... So, I'm about to stop, man. I, I'm going to do some... Though, when you're in the music menu... um, in, in case people forget about this, I just wanted to show one quick thing. Hold on, let me go to... If you you can play it, like yeah. you you can play it and hear what it sounds like. I love this track. So you can also play it in the my music section, but you can play it out of hmm. this menu if you want to hear what they sound like. Also, I love that mass destruction made into this game. Also, I when I found out the first one of the reviews, like I just assumed instantly that mass destruction must be in there. So I'm about to stop then. I I think that's like. Is that Persona 3? Babe, 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 babe. Oh, that one. <laughs> oh, yeah, and if you back out, it'll hold the music. Yeah. I forget the menu does that. Can I play, can I play around? Um, oh, well, I'm I want to end the recording. I mean, for, hold on. So, I'm about to end the recording. So, basically, we did the classic mode, extended a little bit... <laughs> To wipe out all of these jerks. Every one of these. Those are all done. I showed Sean the victory screen. Wait, there is one quick funny thing I can pat out for just a minute. What? It was something I just remembered. Just, hold on. I have... I might do a small cut before ending this. All right, let me. Hey, hey. Oh, yeah, it's <laughs> there it is. Mm. Makes cool, sense. Joker. Yeah. Again, this is the man that made. I, I just wanted to hunt. basically oh, God, hard cut before ending was. Mm. <laughs> and just hey. him talking. It's. Wait, can you aim by that train? No, it's a hitbox. It just... It will kill you if you touch it. Cool, 
So. But you could also sing. Okay. So, for real this time, I, I had to get the. That that's a taunt. They they made it a taunt. Also, um, for so, just uh, one other quick thing: is tether recovery can grab people. Yeah. That's cool. That does continuous damage. That's the charging counter thing where you could get hit. Yeah. Oh yeah, he has a baseball slide. So I'm, I'm about to stop for real. Like, his smash attacks don't have a lot of... What's his persona based off of? Tether recovery! Arsene. So... No, I meant what is that from? Arsene. So, in the literal name of the thief it's based off of? Mm -hmm. They all are. So... All of their personas... Look. Yeah. Prometheus. So, I'm... All of their personas are based off of thieves. Yeah, so, I'm about to on. I just want to... Yeah, all of their personas are based well, off of, like, legendary was, thieves. What I so, meant was final that thing! Was like, uh, they're act they were, you know... What, what I meant was that was, like, is it from a book or something? Because, you know... If you hold the button, it goes a little bit longer. You know to say? So. Okay. So, basically, that... Is now stronger and does more residual damage. That's a counter. Wings of Rebellion is just a huge recovery. He's invincible when doing it, but it has absolutely no attacking power. And his smash attacks are ridiculously ranged, as are his jabs. Excellent. Is what I wanted to show off. Oh yeah, then his uh, up tilt gains electric damage for some reason. And he has gone. You can hold guns. Uh -huh. The persona Which gets. Which means Kirby can also now hold a gun. We really do need to stop this. Yes. So I'm about to stop for real. I just wanted to show people the basics of. So that's the basics of him and his up smash. The persona just adds a lot of power. I just wanted to explain the basic moves and the whole grabbing on and his. His grab range is really small, but he has some really good throw potential. Okay, we need to stop now. Well, since I've padded out this long before we stop, I do want to show it what the guns under the RCN look like. So, hold on. Oh, yeah, then when you yeah, it's more bullets and it's... Christ. I, I don't believe it does more damage, but what it does is now... He's shooting more bullets per second. Yes. Every gun press shoots okay. three bullets instead of one. You can hold it. Yes. Okay. So, I'm about to stop. For real, then. Let me, let me quit. Okay, guys. I showed off the final little rambly thing, and with some cuts... I'm likely cutting this into one part, maybe two, of it'll be classic mode and then the spirit board. The spirit board, so that way it's separated better. We recorded a little bit longer than I wanted to, but the spirit board took a minute and I had to show Sean the stupid shit because I thought he would appreciate that. Anyway, I hope you all enjoyed this DLC update. Joker is live and is like, what was it, $5.99? Technically $4.99. Oh, wait, yeah, $4.99. $5 DLC. It's up. You get the stage, you get the music, you get the character. Mm -hmm. So, this has been a DLC update video. See you guys next time. For whatever the hell we post, this is going out of order like last time. This might even be two parts, just so the spirit board and this remaining nonsense is its own video. But we need to go, so I'm going to end this recording and fade into the end slate now. It's time for the question of the day and my overall thoughts on the topic. So, anyway, what did you guys think of the DLC spirit board? Personally, I thought it was really good. It feels like a lot of time and work went into these spirit battles. 
all these subtle details and nuance make them feel incredibly well crafted. It feels like the team cared about the source material and did not half ask the spirit battles for a quick add on for the DLC. It actually feels like they were all properly developed with a lot of time and care. And overall, I think they were really good fights. Plus, I like the fact that you don't have to play that stupid shooting minigame and you just earn the spirits. That was a very good plus, in my opinion. On top of the fact that I enjoyed the battles due to all the stuff I just said. But anyway, I would really love to know what you guys think. You can leave your thoughts, opinions, and answers in the comments, or you can leave them on social media. My social media links are in the video description. Now, I need to be a shill for a minute. If you liked the video, hitting the like button and leaving some comments really helps. If you want to keep up with our videos, hitting the subscription button and ringing the notification bell also really helps. And if you follow me on social media, it helps our communities grow. But anyway, I hope you all enjoyed this video. See you all next time.